Hi everyone, my name is Stephanie and I'm blind. Here, let me show you something that I use on a daily basis. So this is my white cane. It's red on the bottom and right on top with a rubber handle and a string. Not everyone's cane looks like that and that's okay. And no, I don't have a guide dog. I do, however, have a pet name. And this is Lola. She's seven. She likes going outside, going for car rides, and sleeping. Her favorite things are being petted, hot dogs, and her toys. So come join us as we show you what it's like living life as a blind person. What's that? Oh. You thought Willow was blind too? Nope, Willow's not blind. It's just me. What? Oh, okay, fine. So come join me and I'll show you what it's like living life as a blind person. But Willow's tagging along too. Sometimes. Most of the time. I was about to sit down and edit the video that's going up today and I randomly found her piece of a chicken that's left so we're gonna throw it and see what happens hey you want this toy you want that you do ready go get it yeah bring it back now let's play in bring it back Bring it back, Willow. I haven't really done anything all day. I really want to work on homework, but I don't have the PDF of the textbook. And I would rather have that so that I can go back and look stuff up. If I need to, and then I don't have to be like, hey, help me. Read this five billion times. But I don't have the PDF yet and it's driving me nuts because all I want to do is catch up on homework. Like, I'm in quarantine. I'm not doing anything else with my life. You know? I have cuddled with Willow. And Lacey's listening to music. So I guess I'm listening to music too. And I'm just kind of sitting here. I just finished putting the video into, like, different sections, I guess, so that I could add sound effects. I'm, I'm really happy with the way this video turned out. I had to rearrange a couple of clips because they weren't where I wanted them to be because I didn't want them to be in the order that I filmed them in. But that is all I've done for that video. I think of making videos, and you guys might think that I'm completely insane, but I think of making videos like writing a story. Like you're basically composing a story. Like you're putting together what clips you want to be together and what clips you don't want to be together. And it's just kind of fun. <laughs> I feel like my videos are like really boring and that's why nobody's watching them and I don't blame them because sometimes I'm like I don't want to watch my own video also while I'm rambling I uploaded a TikTok today took forever but that's up feel free to follow me on TikTok you can find that on my YouTube page below the about section and down in the description below and I have an application that I have to fill out in order to student teach. I actually forgot about it because I downloaded it the day that I went into quarantine. So I guess I'm going to try to start filling that out. I'm really anxious because it's a PDF and I'm unsure if I'm doing it right, so... I guess we'll find out. 
it's basically an application for my student teaching because student teaching is like a separate thing so you have to get approved by like some sort of board or whatever I don't really know how that works I read the entire email but all I remember is something about a board like you have to have a place on the board if you're going to student teach and if you don't have that placement then you will not be approved or something like that. I may have totally misread that because I was focused on trying to get an email to the principal at the school where I was supposed to observe to tell her that I had to go on quarantine. So I wasn't really paying that close of attention to the original email, so I'm gonna need to go back and reread that. But <laughs> that's the plan, we'll see what I get done. I would honestly rather work on my homework. I know that sounds awful, but I would. I hate filling out documents. Well, I was gonna get a video of her being cute, but then she laid down and wasn't that cute anymore. She was being super cute, like she was standing in between my legs and she was looking up at me and it was just the cutest thing. Oh. Are you so cute? Push her around. Push her around. She's like, eh, not in the mood. Are you not in the mood to be pushed around? You're so cute. I am going to go to bed. I'm exhausted. I spent I don't know how much time trying to find a textbook so that I could catch up on my schoolwork without having to have my cousin read me the hardback copy. I think Learning Ally might have it. Learning Ally is a thing that most people don't like, but they basically read textbooks and they use a lot of inmates and things like that, but it's either Learning Ally or Learning Alley. I've heard it pronounced both ways, but I think it's actually pronounced Learning Ally. I checked Bookshare. Bookshare doesn't have it. I had a friend check Bard. They don't have it. Kind of knew Bard wouldn't, but I figured I'd give it a shot. <laughs> anyway, with that being said, don't forget to follow me on TikTok. It is Steffi. It is Steph on YouTube One. And you can find that on my YouTube page below the about section and down in the description below. Good night, all. <laughs>